I can't turn around. Oh my god. Wait, are you real? I'm real. Oh my no god. They're so cute. I hope they got married and had a bunch of babies. <sighs> Did they not? They broke up. Wait, what happened? We want the tea, Neve. That's why we're here. Yeah, I need to see if this guy's real. <laughs> Thank you for bringing her to me. I can't believe I can't it. Stop saying. This was, I think, the, the happiest I've been on like while life? making an episode of the show. I remember just feeling joy. Oh. I was so happy. I'm looking forward to reliving yeah. that moment with you. And they look like the perfect little couple. Oh, that was cute. Is, is this weird actually touching you? I know. Thank you for being you. I told her. She didn't believe me. They're so cute. I hope they got married and had a bunch of babies. <sighs> Did they not? No. Well, they got engaged on a reunion show. Yes, yes, yes. Which was amazing. And Max and I went with him that day. We bought the ring, but they broke up. Wait, what happened? We want the tea, Neve. That's why we're here. Here's what happened. She got pregnant and it was like a false pregnancy. Mm. But Derek did, wasn't on board. Mm -hmm. Anyway, it didn't work out, and so when I found out it was over, I asked for the ring back. Yeah, duh, where's the money? That's, I was about to ask that. Invoice I bought her the ring, mm -hmm. gave it back. Mm -hmm. And she thought that was the rudest, most insensitive thing I'm sorry, ever. Catfish, Catfish Budget bought that ring, so. No, no, me and Max bought that ring. Wait, the show didn't buy the ring? No, we bought it. Did you guys have a contract? No. We just, you know, we wanted to support young love. Hi. Hi. What's up? What's going on? Hey, man. Are you Elijah? Ah. Uh, no. You guys want to come in and meet him? Is he in here? Yeah. Well, this was weird because it seemed like it was not going to go well because mm -hmm. this guy opened the door and he obviously is not at all the picture of the, like Elijah is mm -hmm. this emo dude with long hair. Mm -hmm. MySpace scene guy. Totally. Screamo. Mm -hmm. And we all thought, oh boy, okay, this guy's a good catfishing her. And then it got weird, weirder, and strangely somehow also better. I don't know what's going on. That was weird. Is he just gonna come back? I don't know. This guy was so weird, it just felt like he was gonna bring us in and like Elijah was gonna be tied up. Yeah, like, exactly. Bagged. In a closet. In a, yeah. Oh, He's you been here for come, five come years. Come meet Elijah. He's like, a, mm. he's like dead already, but they've got like pulleys and his arms are just like. Ew. Uh, you don't ever think, tell him to come outside? Because you could be a murderer? Yeah, when you get invited in. Mm -mm. Oh my God. Dang, you look gorgeous. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Who are you? Oh yeah, he was the one! And it was him. It was him. And he is a scene guy. Yeah. It's got It's a Justin Bieber thingy. And they would like to do that with their hair all the time. Nervous now. <laughs> They're real. Yeah. I'm real. They're real. Is the hair real? Yeah, my hair's real. It doesn't look real. I know. It seemed like it was gonna be a happy ending, but what was also going on, I don't know if you remember this, mm -hmm. was that Solana had, because of his flakiness mm -hmm. had been dating this other guy yeah. in her hometown. Yeah. So that she ended up going back home and marrying her boyfriend, which was a huge mistake, and that didn't last very long. So it was like a happy ending, kind of, mm -hmm. but then Solana made a few life decisions that I think, unfortunately, didn't go so well. And last I heard, she was like working at a strip club I in- I knew you were gonna say that. I uh, knew it. In like Samoa. Or, or some really, really random, like, South Pacific island. Yeah. Solana, if you see this, I hope things are going well. And if there's, you know, anything Cammy can do to help. How am I supposed to help her? I don't know. If I'm in Samoa, I'll come patron yeah. her club. I'm very good at that. Do you have feelings for Kelsey that, that are in line with everything you've told her on the phone and stuff? Oh, absolutely. Yep. Absolutely. Oh yeah, Redneck Romeo. You remember this one? What? That was what he called himself, I think. He showed up on an ATV. Okay. He like told us to come out to this very remote lake side 
like dirt road. And there's some guy in a fishing boat and we're looking at him like, could that be the guy? I don't know, a little bit on the nose here with like catfishing, mm -hmm. literally. And, mm -hmm. and then we hear coming through the woods like this and he, you know, he showed up on an ATV. She was probably so into it, she's like, oh my God. He's also, yeah, he's kind of stud. He's yeah. stud. Are you on the universe's side yet, Are you? <laughs> Are you officially on the universe's side, Max? <laughs> Max really thought there was no chance that it could be him. And, you know, I, I can't maintain Optimist. that there was a chance, yeah. Did they end up together? Well, his whole thing, he had all the excuses, right? He was like, my truck broke down. It probably did. Yeah, and it did. No, he did, <laughs> right. There were like all these things that sounded so phony that turned out to be real. My ATV start working. You know, when I live in the country, I don't get good service. I had to go to the top of the hill if I want to send a picture, you know? Oh, that's cute. You know, normally in these situations, we're, we're asking questions because we don't know what's true and false. And, yeah. But I think it sounds like everything we know about you is. It's true. Just the lie that I, you know, right. that I told to and so you be did here. It. Oh boy. Do you remember this one? This was the, fr this was like the first time that we got catfish on the show. Like that, where we got used or played. Oh God! This is someone used us, used the show to meet the other person because they were far away. But we found out while we were filming. We figured it out, and we confronted her and caught and like caught her in her lie, and had to decide: should we keep making the episode or and like mm. let this happen or scrap it? But we kind of felt like it was cute. You guys did a pretty good job. You pulled one over on us for the most part. I'm I mean, sorry. I know. Oh, it's kind of sweet. Did they end up together? Do I think, you know? well, I don't know if they're still together, but they definitely were, were together then. I feel like it's not the worst thing. Well, anyway, disclaimer to everyone watching, don't catfish someone or pretend to be getting catfish just to get on the show. That's yeah, not nice. That was a happy ending. I did like that. They were sweet and they really did care for each other mm -hmm. and it was genuine. So we were, we were, we were into it. First and the last of the allowed Right, made. permissible yeah. catfish cons for love. We've never been two hopeless hook up. An identical twin. <gasps> Everybody in Hawaii is in on this. <gasps> That's insane. You've never seen anything like this. The catfish sent you the real guy's Facebook page. Come on.